But we're still in the southwest, but this time in Ekiti State, where students from various higher institutions of learning in that state have thrown their weight behind the new law prohibiting cultism and terrorism in the state. The state governor, Mr. Ayodele Fayoshe, had earlier in the week signed into law a bill prescribing the death penalty for anyone caught in the act of cultism or terrorism. Now, during a solidarity walk in the state capital, Adoikiti, the students carried various placards expressing hope that the law would help bring an end to the menace. They were received at the governor's office by the deputy governor, Professor Kolakwa Olushala, who commended the students for backing the law. For the fact that the safety of the citizens and the students of ADT is at the heart of the government, we are here to appreciate them and also to show our support, our unwavering support for the state government, most especially from our own constituency. I commend the students' body today, the entire student body in the ADT state for coming around today to protest against cultism and to support uh, the anti-cultism law. A situation where destinies will be cut short. This law will go a long way, this anti-cultism law, in discouraging and telling people that once you kill, you deserve to die. 